So, ah, uh, autofocus, damn. <laughs> Sorry. So I'm sure you guys have heard by now that Jennifer Gardner is going to be in Deadpool 3. And, yeah. Just really, like, take that in. We're De Jennifer Gardner is going to be in Deadpool 3 and back as Elektra. This was news that came out a couple days ago, and I had been meaning to get around to it. And I decided to kind of just really give my thoughts on just kind of like all the things we've been get all the news we've been getting for Deadpool three. At first, it was just a lot of like you know X Men, and this was like oh, okay, this is how we get the X Men into this universe is via um, you know the T. It does look like the TVA is going to be involved. It does look like Loki Season 2 is going to play into it, even more so now, now that we know that Deadpool, th Deadpool 3 has been upped to March of next year. So we do know that, that, that this is all going to be important. But then out of nowhere, Jennifer Gardner gets announced as, hey, she's coming back for uh, Elektra. And yeah. Now, the Elektra movie's not good. Let's let's be real. It sucks. It's straight up sucks. Like I forget that movie half the time. Right up there with Halle Berry's Catwoman. And it's not because it's it's female superhero movies. It's really because they're just really bad movies. And now I've heard rumors that like Ben Affleck's Daredevil it might appear, which would be hilarious and also be par of the course. Um, and it makes me wonder. And also, I will say. Like, Jennifer Gardner's Electra movie, I've only watched three times in my life, on three separate occasions, and, and like, the first time I was like, oh, it's kind of imaginative. Second time, I'm like, this is bad. Third time, I was like, yeah, this is pretty bad. Um, but I never hated Ele Jennifer Gardner as Electra herself. I gotta give credit where credit is due that she did put herself into the role. I'll give her that. But that movie, I, I blame more of writers and directors than her, because she actually, like, gave a shit about, you know, doing the work in, in into the role. So, to have her back as Elektra in this continuity says a lot. Now, we don't know what the role is, We and again, like, uh, could Ben Affleck's Daredevil show up now? Probably. I think it could be that... The, they make I think it's more of a cameo appearance. I don't think this is going to be Elektra is going to play a major part in the movie. I really don't think that's what's going to happen. What I do think is going to happen is that we're going to see like Wolverine and Deadpool appear. They're going to show up and they're going to be fighting their way through the TVA and it's going to be like a cameo appearance of Garner as Elektra and Wade might make a joke or two and then move on. And that's and that's it. It's the same thing with, like, if if Affleck is Daredevil in this film, I imagine it's probably going to be, like, kind of like a, a, a quick gag like uh, Brad Pitt in Deadpool 2. That's what I'm kind of thinking. And I know a lot of people have been saying, like, oh, maybe Jennifer Gardner's Elektra is going to play a major role. And I'm like, you guys clearly don't know Deadpool. Like, you guys clearly don't know these movies. And it does look more and more that this is how we are getting the X-Men into these films. So, it's, um, I'm not going to say this is bad. I'm not going to say this is bad at all. And in fact, I actually laughed out loud because I thought that was just so ridiculous. And it all but confirms that, yeah, the TVA is playing a major role in this, maybe even as the main antagonist, and it does look like more and more this is how we get the mutants in the MCU, because, yeah, how like, how else, right? And to see Deadpool fight his way through the TVA, and, and I, I am pretty sure this movie's just going to be full of jokes, and also cameos from other movies i am i guarantee you we'll probably we might get a toby Maguire. we might get andrew garfield we might get uh nick cage ghostwriter i know nicholas cage said oh i'm not uh, i'm nick cage i don't need to be in the mcu money talks nick money talks nick so i'm sure we'll get like nick cage's ghostwriter i am sure we will get it would be kind of hilarious if we got um eric banna uh eric banna and his hulk that's what I'm kind of banking on, is that we are probably more than likely 
going to be getting just a ton of references thanks to the TVA. And while I don't want that to be the MCU where it just banks on past movie references and nostalgia, um, I really don't want that. It would kind of, it would work a lot in Deadpool, especially in this kind of story, because Deadpool's joining the MCU. He's gonna make jokes. He's going to make a shit ton of jokes about all of this, and it would make a lot of sense to do that. Like, it would make so much sense to play around with the idea of Deadpool's in the MCU, now let's talk about all the other stuff that he could be making fun of through this story. So, yeah. All around, I am interested. It do, uh, I think this won't be... W could this be a big role? Yes. Could, do I think it will be a major role? Not really. I think it will just be there for a gag and, elect and uh, uh, Garner will get her paycheck. That's pretty much how I see it. I'm not I'm not trying to say, oh, fuck Jennifer Gardner as Electra. I'm not trying to say that at all. I'm just saying, like, it's really cool that she's going to be in the movie. But it's, it's probably going to be for a gag. Now, I could be wrong, and she could play a major role in the movie, but I don't see that. Personally, I could be wrong, and I've, I've been wrong before. So I, it's really, like, who knows? Like, we real none of us really know at this point, so... I am just going to leave it off at that. Like, that's really all I can say. So, um, yeah. But you guys tell me in the comments below, what do you guys think of all this news for Deadpool 3? Like I said, I didn't, uh, I'm sorry I didn't talk about this news sooner. I've been meaning to, and I've just been meaning to get around to it. But, yeah. Anyway. So you guys tell me in the comments below, what do you guys think of Deadpool, of this news for Deadpool 3? Are you guys excited or are you guys not? And do you think we'll get other, like, cameos of the, from other Marvel movies? Do you think we'll get cameos from, like, Ben Affleck's Daredevil? Do you think we'll get Nick Cage's Ghost Rider? Could we even get, like, I don't know, like I said, Garfield or Maguire or even, like, who knows how uh, who knows uh, who else right like who know uh, like we could even get wesley snipes blade like that's that's another one that's a possibility but anyway uh once again hope you all enjoyed this i'm mr multiverse i'll see you next time in the multiverse